Hey YouTube, Matt M. Roy back once again, coming to you from my grandmother's house in the TV room. Got an interesting uh, VCR here for you guys. My grandmother's neighbor for many years, a uh, very good friend of mine, name is Sandy, just give a little shout out there, uh, was taking a bunch of her old electronic items to the electronic recycling that they have uh, once a month here in the town of Green. It's uh, sponsored by her church. Well, as she was putting this in her car, I said, wait a minute, does this actually work? And she told me she wasn't sure. She said it did the last time she used it, but it had been several years since then. Um, what this actually is, is a Panasonic. Let me shed some light on the situation here. <laughs> Panasonic video cassette recorder and this is actually from 1984 she actually remembers buying this from Montgomery Wards in the beginning somewhere around February of 1984 uh, if you look on top this is what they call the uh, top loader VCRs because when I hit power and then eject which is right here you can see that it pops up and you actually put the tape in here I'll show you guys what that looks like. Uh, here we go. You actually stick the tape right in here, and then you push it down. Now, oddly enough, she said she had two of these, but uh, about a year ago, she got rid of the other one because the uh, belts had worn out. It's kind of a shame. I would have liked to have tried to fix that one. But what she did have is the original remote controls. You can see that this is a Panasonic remote control. And let me bring this over to the light so you guys might be able to see this a little better. As you can see, we have uh, power, channel up and down, the two record buttons. To record this, you actually have to push both of them together. The VCR and TV. And as you can see, it just started recording when I pushed that, so I'm going to go ahead and stop it. And we also have the rewind fast forward, pause, forward advance, I'm not exactly sure what that is, and then the uh, slow motion. But you can see that it, for the most part it works good. Uh, the fast forward is fairly quick. And if you see on top here, I don't know if you can, let me turn the light on. You can see that the... Uh, tape is spinning pretty quickly. I mean, it's not as fast as a modern VCR would be, but still not too bad. Uh, over here we have the counter reset, timer, and this is all for the programming of um, recording shows and the clocks. You have on, off, select, and set. Here you have uh, 13 programmable channels because this is not a cable ready VCR so the most channels you can actually use are 2 through 13 on the cable the uh, UHF band I'm sorry the VHF band and in here is actually where you program it say you wanted to program a channel into the number 2 setting well you would find the corresponding uh, adjustment which is this one and you would just keep turning it until you found the channel you want right is channel up and left is channel down and that also took care of the fine tuning as well uh, automatic fine tuning you could turn on and off and this is your quick record button so if you push that you can record for 30 minutes 60 minutes and up to two hours I believe down here you have your different speeds we have standard play long play and super long play usually don't see the uh, long play on the modern VCRs or as modern as you can get these days. Uh, slow tracking and tracking. So two different types of uh, tracking available. This one for the slow motion and then this one just for the uh, regular. So let's go ahead and look at the back of this VCR. Oh, before I do that, you can actually see this does have a remote control uh, LED which is right there, uh, responder. And then, again, your power button, eject, rewind, play, fast forward, record, slow, stop, pause, and to go from the VCR to the TV. Now, looking at the back of this, 
we'll see if I can do this. You can see it's just fairly basic. You have your power cord, which is here. You have your in from antenna and out to TV, coaxial cables. And you'll also have the older style um, connectors. This is what they used to use before the coaxial cables came out. So you have the options there as well. Underneath you have your standard RCA jacks for video in. I'm sorry, audio in, video in, and then audio out and video out. This is not a stereo VCR by any means. Your channel 3 or 4 selection. Uh, your remote, so if you had a remote that had a cord on it and that was an option, you would put it right there. And then your camera remote, because you could actually hook up uh, camcorders to this back in the day. Well, now that I forward this a little bit, go ahead and hit stop. We're going to go ahead and give this VCR a try. And this is not copyrighted, this is from a play that my aunt was in. So don't get me on this, please, YouTube. All right, I turn, put the VCR on uh, number 13 because that's just static, so the copyright police won't get me. We're going to go ahead and give this a try, so I'm just going to go ahead and hit play. And you can see the tape is getting ready to turn. We can go ahead and fast forward if we want. And on these older ones, you actually have to hold the button to fast forward. Rewind also works. And we have the pause, which is right over here. And because this is, a, I believe, a two-edge VCR, that's why you kind of get that uh, strobing effect right there. And let's see what the forward advance is. I think that might advance it just like 30 seconds. That's not working. Slow motion. Now this is where that slow motion tracking comes in. You see how it's not very clear? Well, if I go here and adjust that tracking, it should clear up a little bit. Okay, yeah, this is an old tape. So normally, uh, if it was like a pre-recorded tape and I did that, I should be able to get rid of most of that, uh, the lines in the picture. So go ahead and hit play again. And as you can see, this uh, VCR works perfectly for its age. Go ahead and hit stop. And if you want to look at it, I'll show you guys the uh, back of the remote here. Focus. There's the information on the remote. You guys can pause the video if you want to read that. And some information about the uh, operation of the uh, timer. Again, you can pause the video if you want to read that. And that's about it, guys. I just thought you might like to see this vintage 1984 uh, Montgomery Ward Panasonic VCR. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please remember to like and subscribe. And as always, have a blessed day, everybody.